right, thank you so much, Ayinka. Up next, we're going to be chatting with the Vice President of the National Paran Association, Mr. Neil Marcano, is on the line to tell us about their celebrating 50th anniversary of Paran in Trinidad and Tobago. Good morning, Mr. Marcano. Good morning, Rockers. How are you and doing good this morning? morning? And it's viewers. Nice to have you here. Thank you uh, for joining us this morning, and congratulations on, on the 50th anniversary of, of Parang in Trinidad and Tobago. Tell me, how are you guys celebrating? Well, um, Rockers, um, we are doing, well, it's going to be a, a full year of celebration, mm -hmm. but we are going to be starting um, this Sunday. Um, of course, we have to praise the Almighty first, so we're starting a Mass at the Assumption Church in uh, Maraval. That's at 4 p.m. Right. And then we have our awards gala celebration, which will take place at Queen's Hall on the Monday night from 7 to 9 p.m. Right. And we have other things after that. But I mean, those are the two major things that will um, commence the one year celebration of this 50th. All right. So this, this celebration starts from the 19th, you're saying? Oh, no. Yeah. Starts from the 19th. The 18th. Yeah? The 18th. It'll be the Sunday. Yeah. Right. The so 18th will be the, be the mass, and the 19th will be the award ceremony. Right, and then you go celebrating for the, the entire year. Now, traditionally, we, we know Parang um, gets all the focus at Christmas time in particular, but I know you guys want to place some more focus on Parang all through the year. Yes, we have been, well, we, over the years, um, besides Christmas time, we have been trying to um, get Easter Parang off as well, because, you know, you, you can sing Parang songs on the resurrection and the, the death of, of, of Jesus Christ. And we have also been um, doing as well in July, um, Christmas in July. Yes. So we have been trying to get little snippets right through the year of Parang, so persons who are Parang-oriented, or, or, or we could call them Parang freaks, like myself, to get some farm right through the air. Nice. Now, I want to go back a little bit to the, the award ceremony happening at Queen's Hall on the 19th. I understand that you guys are going to be celebrating some parang icons and contributors. Yes, we are. Yes, we are. Yes, Tell we are. me a little well, bit about we, that. We, we, we have a list of, of persons that we're going we're gonna to celebrate. We're not going to give you the whole list this morning. It's going to take a, a while. But we do have awardees that we're going to be celebrating Um for instance, our companies are the sponsors of them who have been with us for the last 50 years. We have been um, doing research over the companies that have been dealing with us over the last 50 years. Um, our past presidents over the last 50 years, we are going to be celebrating them as well. Some of the radio and TV stations as well, including yourself, TTT. Yes, and um, some long-serving bands that we're going to be celebrating as well over the 50 years. And um, we have some posthumous awards that we're going to be um, giving out to, like Daisy Bozze, Gloria Alcazar, Holly Victoria, Wayne F uh, Flores, Wayne Jack Vio, CL2, um, and a lot of other persons who, um, who have passed over the, uh, that time period. All right. Well, fantastic. Tell me, uh, where can people get more information about the National Parang Association of Trinidad and Tobago and how, how they can be a part of this celebration? Well, the mass itself is... Now, you know, with protocols, you know, you need to, um, of course, we can just invite everyone to come out to it. But yeah. the mass that is taking place on the 18th, which is at the Assumption Church, uh, we have a limited amount of persons. We only have 120 persons that can attend that mass. In fact, we have, I think we have a limited of room still because um, all parent news won't be att attending the mass. Right. Um, and, but the gala itself is strictly by invitation. Okay. So there, there's no way you could come to the gala unless you have an invitation. But is there a social media presence that we can we can look at? To it find is you going guys? to be a social media presence. We're hoping um, to have a, it live done live actually. Where? Um, Where can we find that? that link? On that um, on, we are hoping to have TTT that do it live actually. Okay. All right. Well, fantastic. So we look forward to joining you guys and celebrating the 50th anniversary. Yeah. Yep, yep, I yep, yep, thank yep. You so and much just, we just want to tell all Paranderos out there. I mean, we, we, we have been trying to get onto all Paranderos who have been associated with the National Parang Association over the last 50 years. Right. And you know, sometimes you don't get onto everybody. So right. we want to just let all Paranderos know that if you haven't received an invitation, to please contact 487 5394 and we can get an invitation onto you for the award ceremony because we want all Paranderos 
who were involved in some way with the National Parang Association over the last 50 years to um, be at to be that a part of the celebration. celebration because I mean, 50 yeah. years is not a, 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 an easy achievement. All right, fantastic. Well, congratulations and thank you very much for joining us this morning, Mr. Marcano. And congratulations on the 50th anniversary of the National Parang Association of Trinidad and Tobago. What a way to celebrate. It is.